Today my son and I are out plinking in the backyards with our pellet guns. Uh, I'm shooting the Benjamin Trail NPXL 1122 and he's shooting the Benjamin Trail NP in 177. We're just having a little shooting contest. Uh, there's been rumors from somebody that they're a better shot than me. So we're going to see about that today. little friendly shooting competition. I'm shooting the uh, JSB Match Diablo uh, exacts and he's shooting the Premier Hollow Points. Uh, once mine are run out uh, eventually I'm gonna um, go back to the dome for both of us because uh, the Crossman Premier Dome because they seem to work just as good as anything else and they're a lot less expensive. Seth we've seen a lot of guys on the internet shoot uh, cock these guns incorrectly. Can you show us the right way to do it? Yes. Um, hold your gun cock the barrel, hold on to it like this so that it doesn't fly up, take your pellet, then... Okay, why don't you go ahead and take a shot at that squirrel. Okay. I'll see if I can zoom in and watch her here. All right. Oh, nice shot, buddy. Okay, well, let's get on with the competition. He seems to be ready. This is the course that I have set up uh, with these four swinging plates on the bottom. I'll be shooting at the left side of the course, and he'll be shooting at the right side of the course. I've got to hit the bottom left, too, and he's got to hit the bottom right, too. I'm going to let him start off with uh, his gun cocked and ready to fire, and I'll start off with mine empty. And um, this, plate, this target's sitting at about 12 yards. And then we have this knockdown squirrel. He'll be the last target that we shoot at. He's sitting at about uh, 20 yards, and uh, whoever knocks him down wins. And then I've got this next swinging target. Mine's the left, his is the right. It's sitting on about 30 yards. And lastly, we got some tin cans, and the tin cans are sitting on around 40 yards. His is on the right, a little bit bigger. Mine's on the left, a little bit smaller.
of us missed the can. That one had to hurt. <laughs> 